Hey YouTube. Well, Sevio is just taking a swim, but while you're here, I guess I'll show you something that you guys were probably wondering if you're new to this game. Uh, so this is going to be part two of my uh, WoW noob guide, I guess. I was just taking a swim in the waterfall. So, if you saw um, Turtle Shell's m m macro video of the Fertile Druid macro, um, if you're new to the game, then you're probably confused. So let me um, explain and clarify a little bit. And I'll be going through also how to make one, if you want to make one yourself. So, a macro, I have two here. One is called Battle Prep, and the other one is Attack. So a macro, what it does is it's basically... I kind of spent like 100 gold right there. So I um, it's basically uh, a one spell that covers a ton of spells. So, for example, my battle prep, I have it set up so that it'll cast Ice Barrier, Presence of Mind, uh, Icy Veins, Slow Fall, Remove Curse, Molten Armor, and Summon Water Elemental. So every time I click it, it'll go next in line, next in line, next in line. So I can battle prep pretty quickly. So, like this. Ice Barrier, Presence of Mind, Icy Veins, Slow Fall, uh, Remove Curse, and Molten Armor all in a few seconds. And then it'll um, cool down, and then you can use it again. They're actually really freaking hard to make, so that's why I'm here. Um, okay, so you have to go into the macro, okay? And then click new. You can choose whatever icon you want. I'm just going to make a random one. That looks cool. And name it. Okay. So, then you go down here, and what was it? Okay, you type slash cast sequence. Alright, did I spell it right? Yes, it did. Reset. Alright, equals five. Okay, it has to be five. And then a de oh, like a um, colon. A lot of colon, a, a freaking comma, whatever it's called. I suck at English. And then a sp you space and you type in whatever uh, spell you want, but you have to type it exactly how it says in the um, spell book, including uh, caps and everything. So let's say summon water elemental. Okay. So then you do another comma and another space, and the next one you want to cast, say Iceland. Hold on. I always make myself up with Iceland. Then say a next one, say freaking Arcane Explosion. Suck at typing! So, hold on. Pull. Okay, and you can actually, uh, if you want to do one over and freaking over and over again, just what I do is I select it. I select it, then I um, control C, and I go forward. I do the space, control V, another one space control V so if I want to do like three in a row I have three in a row over here you can make these uh, up to 255 characters but I think there's a way to up it so I don't know you can look that up if you want and then say I'll do one more spell uh, re move curse okay so then nothing at the end and you're gonna save it and you can drag this and you can put it in your taskbar, you can put it whatever you want. I'll just put it freaking here, I guess. Because there's nothing there. 
And so when I go to use it, you have to click it for every top for every spell. So it's summon water elemental. Next one was ice lance. Next one is arcane explosion, arcane explosion. And it's apparently cooling down. Or something. What the hell is wrong with this? Hold on. I think I screwed up. After the two arcane explosions. Oh, okay. Yeah. I think. Hold on. Just remember that whole friggin' spell, okay? We only need two arcane explosions. Okay? You're not Kim Jong, you don't need that many explosions. And then you can begin. And then it'll cool down because I finished it. So, okay. Shut the hell up. Nobody cares. Okay, you can't kill it. It's a dummy. You're a dummy too, apparently. So, I had two set up, which is battle prep, which I use before a duel or before a battle, which is... It just basically gives me a ton of buffs up here so that I can actually fight. Oh, and some of the water elementals here too, so... Right now, I'm like friggin' invincible. And after I use that, I kind of just wing it from here. This one has, um, ice... Uh, it'll freeze people. And then after they're frozen, ice lance will do quadruple damage. So then there's ice lance. And there's... Hold on, it's on cooldown, so I'll just go read it. After ice lance, I have cone of cold, which slows them down. Then I remove curses, in case they actually did put the curse on me. Then I frostbolt, frostbolt, frostbolt three times. And then I arcane explosion three time, four times. Then I polymorph them. So... That actually has worked out pretty good. So this is just a video in case you're new. Shut the frig up, you stupid crap. Nobody cares. You can't kill it. Idiot. So, um, this is just for you new players that don't know what a macro is and want it to make one. It's actually pretty hard, but once you get it down, I just made one in a few seconds and for the most part, it works pretty well. Let's give it another shot. Okay, summon retard elemental. One, two, please work. Yes. Okay, it worked all the way through. And yeah, you can do this for any class. You could use um uh turtle shells po uh freaking feral druid one. That one works pretty good if you're ninety feral druid, but. I just kind of whoop these up pretty quick and they work pretty well for my level. I actually made this character a week ago and I'm like level 50. And I freaking spent a hundred gold in the auction house buying two masks of this in the damn cape. It's gay. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed. I hope this helped you. I have killed so many rabbits and squirrels doing this, man. Alright, for the love of the rabbits and squirrels. All vegetarians out there, please like, comment, and subscribe to this video.